welcome back in this video uh, we will try to solve some problems based on current amplification factor or current gain and uh, collector current base current and meter current so let's start the first problem is in a c circuit that means common meter circuit collector emitter voltage is fixed that is 5 volt for base currents 30 microampere to 40 microampere the collector currents are 8.2 milliampere and 9.4 milliampere respectively calculate the current gain so for c circuit we have to calculate beta that is the current gain for common emitter now here we can see the base current is changing from 30 microampere to 40 microampere and as a result the collector current is changing from 8.2 microampere to 9.4 microampere the current is changing that means it is basically ac beta ac so beta ac we can write as beta is basically change in collector current by changing base current so change in means final value minus initial value so final value is 9.4 initial value is 8.2 microampere that is 10 to the power minus 3 ampere and uh, change in base current that is 40 microampere is the final value minus initial value 30 microampere microampere means 10 to the power minus 6 ampere so from here it is 1.2 and divided by 10 into 10 to the power minus 3 and we will take this to in the numerator so it will be 10 to the power 6 so the final value of the numerator will be 1200 and denominator is 10 so beta is basically 120 so this is how we can calculate moving on to our next problem for a transistor alpha is 0.96 calculate beta now beta is basically alpha by 1 minus alpha so 0.96 by 1 minus 0.96 that is 0.96 by 0 0.04 so that is 24 moving on to our last one for a transistor emitter current is 2 micro milliampere base current is 20 microampere calculate collector current and alpha so now we know IE is basically IC plus IB 2 milliampere means 10 to the power minus 3 we have to calculate IC 20 microampere means 10 to the power minus 6 so this is basically 0 0.02 in 10 to the power minus 3 we are taking all these to the, into the power of 10 to the power minus 3 so that we can easily calculate so 2 minus 0 0.02 into 10 to the power minus 3 that is 1.98 in 10 to the power minus 3 micro, uh, 10 to the power minus 3 ampere that is 1.98 milliampere so this is how we can calculate IC now we have to calculate alpha alpha is basically IC by IE so it is 1.98 by 2 that is 0.99 so here we can calculate alpha and IC. So that's it. Thank you.